what is long column and short column and its main difference assalamu alaikum guys welcome back to seven engineers youtube channel how are you everybody are you okay i hope everybody will be fine as you know guys today we will discuss in this important video for long column and short column and its main difference it is important for civil engineering student to know the main difference between a long column and short column and they should also know what is a long column and what is short column so today i will clear your concept about this topic so let's start guys before starting the video for my motivation you must like this video and subscribe the channel with press bell icon if you are new let's start the topic is what is short column the second one is the second one is uh, long column what is long column and the third topic is main difference between short column and long column right as you know guys this is and we can consider dimensions for column from this top view as you can see here okay and this is height of column this is height of column so guys what is long column how we can know this is long column or this is short column the first one is what is short column guys i will tell you this is dimensions of column okay so least dimension for example this one is 0.3 meter and this one is 0.2 meter okay and height of the column for example this is 3 meter so as this long column or short column how you will know this is long column or short column this is the topic so guys first of all i will discuss when the ratio of the effective length when the ratio of the effective length or height of the column to its least lateral dimension so lateral dimensions are these these two but least the less lesser dimension okay of the column does not exceed 12 it is called short column okay this is the simple definition or if the effective length of the column or height of the column when we divide it by least dimension of the column and it gave us less than 12 so it will be short column how as you can see guys short column how you will know this is short column so height of the column okay or i will write here effective length okay effective length divide by least lateral dimension okay lateral dimension when it's less than 12 okay less than 12 so this is called short column okay this is the simple definition of short column now guys the second one is what is the long column so same like this but it should be more than 12 exceed does not exceed 12 and exceed 12 how when the ratio of the effective length of the column to its least lateral dimension exceed 12 it is called long column how as you can see here i don't have space but i will try long column okay when the ratio of effective length okay effective length divided by least lateral dimension okay when it's more than 12 so this is called 
long column right now guys what is the main difference and i will also uh, give you example for this okay when i discuss its difference so now guys what's the main difference between long column and short column as you can see guys this is short column and the other side we have long column so height of our effective length or height of the column divided by least dimension less than 12 this is called short column this is the one difference so what is long column what is the main difference uh, long column and short column especially in first okay so height of uh, column divided by least dimension more than 12 less than 12 height of the column divided by least lateral dimension less than 12 short column more than 12 long column okay this is the first point now the second one is load carrying capacity of short column is greater than compared to long column short column carry more load okay load carrying capacity of the short column is greater than compared to long column and load carrying capacity is less compared to short column or the long column load carrying capacity is less than short column so short column is best it means okay now guys the third one is short column is stronger than long column short column is stronger compared to long column and long column is weaker than short column compared to short column long column is weaker and short column is stronger than long column okay means short column is best the fourth one is subjected to short column subjected to compressive stresses and short column is subjected to buckling stress okay as you can see guys mm, let me erase these okay so okay this is subjected to what compressive stress okay <clears throat> this is long column so it's subjected to buckling okay like this this is long column and the other one is short column okay this is short column it is subjected to compressive compressive stress okay now the last one is short column is fail due to sharing short column is fail due to sharing okay and long column fail due to buckling due to buckling its fail due to buckling like this okay now guys i will discuss is this long column or short column this one so let me find out is this long column or short column as you can see ratio so this is the effective length okay so effective length is 3 3 meter okay because uh, height divided by least dimension if less than 12 this is called short column if less than uh, more than 12 it's called long column so 3 meter divided by least lateral dimension so least one is 0 0.2 meter not 0 0.3 so we will take 0 0.2 meter okay 
so it cross now it become 15 okay so it become 15 so 15 is more than 12 so this column is called this one this is long column okay this is long column so guys, uh, this is the important topic and you should know what is the long column, what is short column. So which one is the best? You can uh, compare uh, these points with each other. So height of, uh, height of the column divided by least dimension less than 12. So this is short column. More than 12, long column. So load carrying capacity of the short column is greater than compared to long column so short column is best and load carrying uh, load carrying capacity is less compared to short column okay so this is not good from short column so uh, stronger than long column so short column is stronger than long column compared to long column uh, short column is best stronger and weaker than short column this is weaker than shorter column so this is subjected to compressive stress and this is subjected to buckling stress okay and uh, short column fail due to sharing and long column fail due to buckling so now you can find out which one is the best so i've already discussed the front of you what is short column what is long column and main difference between long column and short column guys if you have any question related with this topic so you can comments i will try to replay your answer but guys comments for next video in comments box so i will try to record that video so thanks for watching see you in next video goodbye